sandwiches with gravy on top as my first little snack. So when I was talking about, hey, and, and Chef said it too, it doesn't have to be just a breakfasty thing. This is where it gets really fun. I love, there's one recipe inside here. It's a patty melt. They did waffle mix and a hamburger and cheese inside it and made a delicious patty melt. I thought, oh my gosh, Chef, we didn't talk about this. You could make a Cuban. Can you imagine how much fun, Chef? Oh, yeah. A Reuben or a Cuban would be in this. A Reuben or a Cuban. <laughs> You know, I've, I've tried to make a special one for each of my hosts. Okay. So last night, I actually kicked off with a Cuban. I did the barbecue for you, because I know you're barbecue crazy. And I actually did a pulled pork filled one before. Here's a chicken pimento. Check this one out. This is the silver. Have we still got the silver, or is that sold out? I'm not sure, still but have it's the beautiful silver. regards. Oh, we do, great. Mm -hmm. I mean, have a look at this. It just falls apart. You can see the thickness that you're getting in that waffle. Listen to it, crispy. Super, super crispy on top. And of course, inside, wonderful and fluffy. Oh, yes. So that's the chicken pimento. We've gone ahead and used a little breaded chicken in there so you can use some leftover fried chicken. By the way, this, my friends, is perfect for leftovers. As we get into the end of the year, I know what it's like. We're buying gifts, we're thinking about entertaining, and we're also starting to watch our pennies, right? So the great news here, is when you make one of these waffles, if you were to go out to a cafe or to a deli, the average waffle costs somewhere between nine and 13 bucks, right? We did a little research. Guess how much it costs to make one of mine? For the waffle batter, 55 cents. <laughs> so that costs 55 cents, plus whatever you want to stick in it, which you've probably already got in the fridge anyway. So, you know, it's such a bargain. In fact, a couple of waffles making these at home instead of going out for them pays for the purchase <laughs> it's so true. crazy now this is That's this a is actually point. a cake <laughs> this isn't a waffle um batter this is actually a cake batter and if you've never had hot cake before you've got to change um what you're doing because i tell you what hot cake straight out of a waffle iron steamy on the inside drizzled with just a little bit of frosting wait chef, i mean it I have just a question doesn't get any you. better than that I have oh, a yes, question. Yes. Could I, I just thought of this one. Could I use a um, um, a bread mix in here? Would that work? Like if it was pre, you know, easy to do? We've used a pizza base. We've okay. used a cornmeal. And like if, if you're making cornbread, we've used a cornbread base. So a bread mix should work. I haven't tried it. So I don't want to say definitely, but it should absolutely I work. A waffle, we of course are giving you the recipes, right? So we've given you all of these different recipes in here. In fact, there's 24 beautiful recipes. We've, we've um, taken the images of all of those and you can pick those up. In fact, we've got a little animation that shows you the breakfast, lunch and dinner of it all. Um, so we're giving you some things to try, but like I say, don't be limited by what we tell you. Go ahead and try different things for yourself because the things are just so, so easy to do. Here's the animation that actually shows all of the different inspiration. I mean, look at those different breakfast items. There's lunch items, of course, snacks, dinners, desserts, you name it and you can make it. There's all, you can get really creative or you can just keep it for a, a fun Sunday. And that's what happens at the Stone household. Every single Sunday, we all have breakfast together and then the kids go off and play sports. Sometimes they bring them back because they've had the waffles in their morning. They're like, Dad, uh, meet the rest of the team and we're here for more waffles, please. And I'm like, yeah, no worries, fellas, let's go. Uh, I keep sense. a couple of them, Susan. Uh, you asked for the Cubana, I'm going to make you one. Are you really? Yay! Simplicity. Okay, guys, and a quick oh, yeah, update. Look. I'm sorry, the silver-black combination that Chef just used, that's already sold out. We've sold out of the red-black. The next one's going to go is the black-gold. And then after that, the classic blue and black is only 600 left. So, you know, basically, I'm trying to keep you updated. But if you love this and you think, oh, my gosh, and my kids will love this, I'll love it. I'm going to give it as gifts to the teachers and the people around me because it's $20 a piece. Get it right now. Now, I think Chef has maybe one more airing coming up later on tonight. We'll have to check. But this is going to be wildly limited by the end of the day. And when it sells out, that's it. I mean, that's it. We just don't have any more. Also, Chef, they went and got me one of the knives that you're using. We have this available. I think we have it in a couple different colors. We're going to keep putting the item number up for the electric knife. This is completely rechargeable. I believe we have black and red. I think we have two colors, black, red. Oh, we have black. I've got the red in my hand, but we just have the... I need to get mine ordered. And this is a completely rechargeable knife. So when you see Chef working with it during this whole presentation, realize I've got this remaining in black only, though. Just a little FYI. They wanted to see it in real life here on the set, um, Chef, so I had him pull one for me. <laughs>
Well, listen, you asked for a Cubano. Oh, yeah, isn't that amazing, that yeah. knife? It's really smart, really smart. You, you asked for the Cubano, and, you yes. know, the only thing that I can... Just to honour you, what I thought I'd do is I'd take a bite for you. <laughs> I dip you it in are a little such mustard. a giver. You are such a oh, giver, Chef. Give Thank you. So you put pork in there. Look, I'm going to ask the ingredients, right? Mm. Did, you put, did you put pickle? Did you put the pickle in? Uh-huh. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, uh, I did. Did you put the Swiss cheese? Oh, yeah. Yes. There it is. You can see it right there. Isn't that a fun? I you mean, can make your own waffle Cuban. Oh, I love that. The crispiness. the crispiness on the outside, the <laughs> fluffiness great. on the inside. I tell you, it is just a joy to eat it. Oh, yes, it's got to be. Oh. All right, guys, I'm going to show you this one, too, because I think this is so much fun. Chef, I don't know if you've ever done this there in L.A., but you can go get really, really fancy, like, pops, like like cake pops for a birthday party. Oh, yeah. And each of them cost a fortune. They're so silly expensive. Or how about this recipe is included in the recipe books. Um, how about make your own? How much fun will that next birthday party be? Instead of having dumb cupcakes or little cake pops or whatever, you're actually serving this. And literally, as Chef mentioned, you're doing this for pennies and the smiles happen and people get so excited think about doing a brownie mix inside here the cornbread we've talked about the pizza dough that you can do inside here don't oh i know what it was biscuit can i use biscuits uh, you know how you get the oh, biscuits yeah, at the store <gasps> absolutely those little ones that go pop yes you can you can put croissants in here you can make french toast in here you can literally <clears throat> we actually took some stuff in we pushed it down and then we grilled it and it got crisp on the outside, just stuffy, not even a waffle batter. You can put mashed potato, <coughs> pardon me, mix an egg through some mashed potatoes and stick that in. So many options. Now look, I've gone ahead and done sort of, this is leftover Mexican food. By the way, you just pull them apart. This is a stuffed waffle maker, you guys. If you're just tuning in, you can see how thick, even if that cheese does start to melt out, guess what? It's my Durapan nonstick, so it is not gonna stick at all. Let's have a little look here. Oh, 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 yes. I mean, that's just a Dang little chorizo, God. a little Mexican cheese. I'm going to serve it with a little salsa. Do you notice that's... how I say a little with everything? But I'm, it's not going to be a little, you know me. There's a little salsa. A lot of salsa. That's so <laughs> a little awesome. Salsa. And a little, a little sour cream. God, makes me hungry. Just that. Okay, can I show you Is mine that, too, I, Chef? I got another one to demo here. I'm so excited oh yeah, about it. Oh, I already oh. ate all the prime rib, by the way. That I ate all up. But here we go. I'm going to oh, open yeah. this one. Now, remember, we said it can be any kind of thing. It could be, let's say you're having a really elegant party. I mean, maybe you're entertaining friends for the football game or whatever. And you're like, I want to do something really elegant. But again, really fun. Like, people walk into your house and say, what in the world is this? And then the party begins. This is a stuffed brie and berry waffle. Look at that. So there's the oh brie, God. there's the berry, and then they gave me a little bit of syrup. Now, I will tell you, you could have the fanciest party on earth, and the minute, minute you have plates full of all these little fun right. waffle pieces, the part, like, because it sets the mood, chef. It's fun, it makes it people happy, and then there, it's yeah. unexpected, which I'm always searching for that when I'm hosting friends and family. Yeah, I mean, look, that's the most beautiful thing, isn't it? As long as you're in the kitchen with your mates, and your mates are your family, your mates are your kids, your mates are the, the neighbours, the people down the road. The beautiful thing is, everyone will have their favourite, whether it's a sweet one or a savoury one, and you're getting two of these. So you can either gift one and keep one, or you can keep them both for yourself. That's what I'd do if I was you. Or maybe I'd buy two sets. Uh, because you can make multiple at the same time. Now, if it, if it by the way, see how that just lifts on out, I just drop it on down. This, my friends, is an Aussie... Um, little surprise. Have a look at it. I've got ricotta cheese in oh, there. You can see how what? that ricotta cheese is melty and fantastic. Let me go ahead and cut into it so you get another um, look at it. And then what we do is we take a little toasted coconut, right? That goes over the top just like that. Then I've got some tropical fruit because in Australia we have tropical fruit. Some are, of course, over there right now. And then we get a little bit of passion fruit and lemon curd. Over the, I oh, mean, come on. Nice. Come on, Are you guys. Are you kidding me? So delicious. They're so good, Chef. Um, <laughs> now, a couple things. I'm going to give you a real quick update, only because, again, we're extremely busy. Um, we've sold out of the silver black. We've sold out of the red black. If you want to get the closest to red, get the cherry. It's almost identical. Just a little bit darker than the original we had. There's only 700 left here. Now, if you just want two black and black, that's fine. Great gifts. That's easy, you know, because it's going to basically work in any interior. If you want the black gold, which happens to 
to be my favy. Last 100, this is not gonna make the next presentation. So that's gonna be pretty much sold out pretty quickly here. This is the black with the stone gray. We're in pretty decent shape there. Now here's another update. The black with the classic blue. So I want you to see that. I have less than 600 now remaining here. So that's it for that. Then we have black and we have the turquoise. We have black, and I really love this fun sunny yellow just because it's bright and happy. We have black and lavender, all the purple girls and guys out there. And we have black and white. I think the black, black, and the black and white are the two easiest for gift giving because you don't have to worry about, well, they like a color. Basically, it's gonna match any interior. The other thing that's really important to note is you get two recipe books that each include 24 recipes and you get two boxes. So everything is bow and go ready. You don't have to fret over it. You don't have to find another box for it. You're ready to go. Personally, for us, I'd probably keep one for me and then give the other one to my son and his girlfriend. They're in their mid-20s. They live by themselves in their apartment. They would love this. Like, they would have so much fun. It would be their every weekend routine. But what I like about it, because it's fast, easy, and simple, and really good, is you'll use it a lot more than you thought. Most people, you ever had a waffle maker? Those things were a hot mess. You had to learn how to flip them and the stuff got all on the sides and then it was all stuck onto the waffle maker. So what did you do? You ended up not using it because it was too hard to clean up. Because Chef uses his famous customer pick, Dura five coat layer nonstick inside here. You get the same durability and cleanup ease as his pots and pans as you do inside this. And Chef, that's a real game changer. That and being able to make them deeper. Yeah. Is that's a really big difference. Cause I'm sure you, in your professional career, you You've probably seen every waffle maker out there, and they're a beast to use and to clean. And sometimes they're hundreds of dollars. I mean, that's the <laughs> truth. Now, this is a very easy one to use. I'm going to show you a couple of other accessories that you've got to pick up on. This is my eight-piece bowl set. They all come with lids. They're beautiful, big mixing bowls. Perfect five-star reviews. There's nine reviews on this product. Every one of them is a perfect five-star review. I'm going to show you how easy it is to make the batter. So in my beautiful big bowl here, I've thrown in some waffle mix. You pour in a little oil a couple of eggs, and then you toss in some water. It is literally that easy when you use one of the mixes from the store. And then what you do is you get yourself an immersion blender, right? Now, this is my immersion blender. Let me show it to you. That's it there. That's the chopper. I can remove it, though, that simply. Then I can put my whisk attachment on, and I can use it as a whisk. Of course, I can remove that, and I can put my double beater attachment. You haven't seen one of those in an immersion blender before, have you? So I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to whisk that up. I've got that on high. You can see how quickly and simply that works. You're going to whisk it for, like, 20 seconds until there's um, no uh, lumps left. So you can just move that bowl around really quick. And you can just see, by the way, this has got a variable speed on it. So if I wanted to go down here, I can go all the way low. I can turn it all the way high. There's a turbo button as well. But in that 20 seconds, I've done that perfect little waffle batter, right? You just click that off and go ahead and wash that. And you keep the actual immersion blender to itself. So that's another item for you. By the way, I didn't talk about those little silicon measuring cups, but I've been using them all day long. They nest beautifully. You can measure, of course, really easily. And then when you're not using them, they nest and go away really simply. Okay, let's make another waffle, shall we? Lemon and blueberry. This is gonna blow your mind. First of all, you lift it up. If you're just tuning in, this is what makes this waffle maker so special. It is that extender ring. It allows you to do stuffed waffles with absolute ease. You pour just a little bit of your mix into the bottom. And that's a waffle mix. I'm using one straight from the store. Then I've got some cream cheese, okay? So put this in in a couple of little dollops, just like that. And then go ahead and put in some blueberries. I've made like a little blueberry compote. You could use a jam as well, of course. Go ahead and load that up, but don't be stingy. Put plenty in. Then a little bit more of that mix, just like that. You go ahead and you drop the lid. Eight minutes later, this is what happens, you guys. The flavor of this blueberry, oh, look at that. <laughs> blueberry cream cheese waffle. Oh my goodness, it's split in half. You know what, because I, awesome. I, I dropped it on the way down, but let me show it to you. This is what you'll do. You'll just pop it back down like this. I'll go straight on through. Same thing, still absolutely perfect. Oh yum, you know what happened, Susan? 
What? We were talking for a little bit too long. Okay, so this normally takes eight minutes. That one was probably in for about 12, and it will get a little too crispy on the outside, of course. So what you need to do is just look out for when that little um, light turns green, and then you're away. Then it's then, then you're ready to, to pull it out. So no worries there. Okay, guys, here's another one just to make your mouth water. How about jalapeno cornbread with chili waffles? And think about the chili you made over this weekend, right? And you're like, oh, you know, we've got some leftover. Reinvent with it. Like, look how delicious. A little sour cream on top you are good to go look at amazing that is and i think that's what this really means it means fun for the family fun for you fun for the people around you whether you live by yourself or you live with an entire family or you have people come over the minute you start playing with this and using it you're like okay this is brilliant it makes food more fun so have fun i think we can't have enough fun in our life quite frankly also if you've got anybody and i don't care if they're teens or they're in their 20s maybe they're in a dorm maybe they're in their first apartment this is a really great item to give them because waffle mix is readily available and then they can use leftovers in the interior just to revamp that leftover food. It's just all about having fun with those around you and really enjoying cooking, but very little effort. That's kind of my alley. I like that idea. Make it wow. Make people go, okay, that is really clever. And please make it really easy on me because I don't want to do a lot of cleanup and I quite frankly don't want to do a lot of effort. That is the formula here. Please remember, <clears throat> you're getting a set of two. I honestly know I'm saying that a lot, but a lot of people half listen. I get, we all do 10 things at once. You get both of these, two boxes, and you're getting two of the recipe booklets that each have 24 really good recipes that'll surprise you. There's one, I can't even pronounce what it's in it. I don't even know what it is. I thought, well, I'll skip that one. This is one of my favorites though. Oh, I wonder, are you gonna do the everything bagel? Because that was good. But how about the waffle patty melts? They took hamburger and put hamburger and cheese inside here and made a patty melt inside our stuffed waffle machine. I mean, that's just fun, good food presented in a really magical way. I'm gonna go down here one more time. Black white's an option. I think that's really gift friendly. We have black and lavender, black yellow. Then we have your bl black and classic blue. This one's almost gone. There's 500 left and that's the black with the classic blue. We have black with turquoise. Then we have black with, this is called stone gray. If you missed out on the silver we had earlier and you want a silvery color, you might wanna go for that. This is my black and gold. This last 50 guys, this will not be available in a couple of moments. And then if you missed out on the black red that sold out, just go to the black cherry. It's a slightly different color of red, but again, I think that's a great option. And there's 600 left there. And then we have black, black. So again, really easy. If this is all about gift giving for you right now, get the black, black or the black, white, and it won't matter what their interior of their kitchen looks like at all. It's going to work for everybody. All right, chef, what are you moving on to next? Well, I wanted you to see how I've, I know my gift wrapping is not the best in the world, but you're <laughs> going to get them in these perfect gift boxes. So all you do is throw a bow on top. Now, of course, you can wrap them up um, super special. They're less than $20 a piece. So if you need a gift for that person that maybe you forget, mm -hmm. uh, we all do it, don't worry. Uh, maybe you go to a secret Santa this year and you need a gift that's less than 20 bucks. Well, guess what? You're abiding by the rules and you're bringing people something unique and fantastic. Merry Christmas, Vanessa. Um, I've, got, I've got two more cool demos here. Have a look at this. Bacon, egg, and cheese mm. in a waffle, you guys. You can see the crispy. I'm gonna lift this up and do it right by my mic for you, because listen to this. Can you hear that? Mm -hmm. It is so crisp on the top, on the outside here, and then the fluffiness that you're gonna get on the inside. By the way, you guys, this is my cordless electric knife. There it is, I'll hold it the right way for you. Great for carving the turkey, great for carving the roast beef. This is the bread blade, it also comes with a carving blade, so it's, a, it's an incredible piece. I have been using it all day, because it's such a wonderful little tool. Oh, breakfast sandwich. Who needs a breakfast burrito when you can have a breakfast waffle? I mean, it's right. so easy. Well, and chef, and think about the money you'll let's save. Let's be yeah. honest, you know, as a busy mom, when Ethan was little, sometimes I just didn't have time to do any kind of cooking for breakfast. So what do you do? You run through a right. drive through and literally for the mm -hmm. price, you know, of using this twice, uh, of trying to buy a drive through breakfast sandwich, you can make it in eight minutes yep. at home so much healthier and so much easier and so much cheaper. You're absolutely right. It just is. You know, that's the 55 cents per waffle. We costed it out. And that's when you buy the store-bought mix. If you make it yourself, it's even cheaper. But if you buy the store-bought mix, 
55 cents per waffle, plus whatever you put in there, of course, but that's normally leftovers. This one, my friends, is a pizza. All right, so have a look at that incredible crispiness on the outside. I'm going to go in there with my electric knife again. All of the flavors that you know oh, and love from great. pizza, mozzarella, you can put sausage, you can put salami, you could put pineapple on ham. Knock yourself out whatever you like in pizza. You put a little of the tomato, of course, and then, oh my goodness, have a look oh at my. how good this oh, looks. Look and imagine the kids or the grandkids coming over or coming home from school. I'm gonna put a little tomato sauce for dipping. I've got some Parmesan, I've got some parsley. That's I go great. straight over there. Oh yeah, I mean, just gorgeous. And here's the best part. Susan, let me show you something. Let me just go ahead, dip that in the sauce. You ready for the cheesy deliciousness? Yes, sir. It's coming. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, there you go. I mean, there it is. Mm. It's so cheesy good. Yeah. Uh, by the way, I want to make, because Chef's using this extensively, I'm even starting to panic just a hair because my husband mm. butchered our turkey the other day. Uh, I have it in black only. So if you're going to get the um, bread and the... Um, Getting close. Yeah. Oh, there's less than a thousand. The electric cutting knife, it comes with two blades. We only have the black, even though both of us are showing you the red. Just want to make sure you knew. Less than a thousand now left. If you also had a butchered turkey like I did, <laughs> please get this one for the person who cut the turkey. He didn't do a very good job. Hey, Chef, I have a question. There's a recipe in here that I honestly can't pronounce, but I want you to explain what it is. It's the citrus ricotta waffles with a tangerine Suzette sauce. What is that? Because oh, that yes. looks so darn good. Well, if I said it to you differently, have you ever heard of crepe Suzette? Yes. Crepe Suzette is that orange with Grand Marnier, and we've done exactly that, but we've done it in a waffle format. And if you think about it, anything that goes into a waffle, any, sorry, anything that goes into a crepe, anything that goes into an omelet, also goes into this incredible stuffed waffle maker. And you're seeing just a few of these 24 beautiful recipes that we've put together for you. I mean, Susan, you're only restricted by your imagination. We're not giving you one of these books. We're giving you two. Two books, two waffle makers. We're going to show up to you in an animation because I really would love for you to see exactly what you're getting and all the inspiration that you'll be taking home. Breakfast items, there's incredible lunch items, dinner items, snack items. All 24 recipes were developed by me and the culinary team over here. They're so talented. We got these samples the very first samples. We had so much fun putting these together. And then we'd go home and with our families, we'd be taking photos. Actually, Troy, one of our team, he took photos of his girls this morning saying, totally approved because he, he had to wait for the culinary team to get it first and then he got it. He was like, totally approved, my girls love it. Watch, right. watch what you can do with leftovers. Check this out, you open it up. By the way, you guys, if you're just tuning in, that is that beautiful little ring, that's the extender ring. You pop that in and it allows you to make big, thick waffles that you can now stuff. I know you're gonna think I'm crazy, but check this out. I've actually got a little piece of leftover pecan pie. I just tried this after Thanksgiving because I had a little bit of pie left over. I take that big, thick crust Great off idea. and the rest I just scoop up I drop it in, oh, right? Of course. All of that beautiful pecan pie, apple pie works, pumpkin pie works, and then you cover it up, just like I've been doing all day long, just like that. Once you've got that covered, right, then you drop it down, you come back eight minutes later, the little green light will flash for you, and here you go, you ready? This is the pecan. You ready for this? Oh, yes, look at that golden brown. <laughs> you can tell how crisp that's gonna be, but wait until you see this. That's ridiculous. I mean, so good. <laughs> Little whipped cream on top of that. Oh my gosh. Can you oh, imagine your leftover yes. apple pie? You got that one last piece of apple pie and you want to transform it. That's going to be so awesome. Okay, guys, so give me, let me give you a couple more updates because I know a lot of the, I mean, we've sold over 40,000 sets. So what are we at? 40, almost 41,000. Um, how many more airing chefs do you have tonight? Do you have one more show? One more show, and I'm just dreading having to call Shannon Smith and tell her that it's sold out before I got to her. So I hope we've got a handful of them left for that last show. You but see. it's going to be tight, because I don't know if we're going to get to do the airing or not, to be honest. Yeah, no, it's going to be really close. So right now, black, white, black, lavender. We have black, yellow. The black, classic blue, that's going to sell out before Shannon's show. I have 400 left. Black, turquoise, I think it's gorgeous. Everybody will jump to that after the classic blue. Black, stone, gray, if you missed out on the silver, I think this is a good alternative. Black, 
black metallic gold. I have 30 left. This will not make Shannon show at all. Then we have black cherry. I have 400 left. Everybody jumped on the cherry because we sold out of the black red and it's very similar in color. And then we have your classic black black. So again, really easy gift giving. Everybody gets two boxes. You get two recipe cards. You get two of everything. So they are two separate gifts for under $20. And to me, isn't that the dream amount? Like, you know, oh, I've got the gift exchange or it's my book club or I'm getting together with my girlfriends. Maybe it's somebody at the office that helps you out and you really want to say thank you. Maybe it's some, your hairdresser or a receptionist at the doctor's office who's just been a doll and kind of squeezed you in on those last minute appointments. This is fabulous because they're going to have so much fun with it. Next time you see that receptionist, you can say, you're not going to believe what we made with this. Oh my gosh, I used that for the big football party everybody came over to. We love it. Or every Sunday we make waffles in it and it's so much fun. We have our own little birthday bar we did with it. You will hear so many fun stories once you get this at home and people start using it and you're going to have a ball with it too. I like this one. We did a little bit of a frittata, which I thought was really interesting. So uh, just a whole bunch of eggs with a lot of veggies in them. And then we put it in the waffle maker. Let your imagination go crazy because basically if it's in a sandwich form or dessert form or whatever form, I think you're going to be able to use this and come up with real magic. But please don't wait. We have a one day price. We have three flex pays right now. We have free shipping on this. Not even the seven $75 mark. We have free shipping right now on this as long as you get it today while it's available as our best foot forward. And chef, I'm dying to know which this one is. Is this the chicken something? This is the chicken pot pie, right? And Vanessa's giving me the sauce for that, I think. Um, while we wait for that, what you saw me do over here in my cherry red was I actually put Parmesan cheese on the top. It's a macaroni and cheese. You ready for this? I just sprinkled Parmesan cheese, right? Just to show you the quality of the non-stick that we're dealing with. Absolutely nothing sticks, not even the cheese. Um, you know what, Vanessa, I'll just go ahead and use something else. Oh, there you go, thanks so much. Um, so that's that beautiful uh, gravy that, you know, I mean, just drizzle a little of that beautiful sauce, that gorgeous uh, <laughs> leftover gravy over the top there. Oh, a little hello. or a lot, chef. And then I'm Come just going to show you the mac and cheese because I know we're out of time here. You guys, mac check, that, check that out. Macaroni and cheese. So oh, yeah. It's good. stuffed with macaroni and cheese. And by the way, he even gives you three waffle recipes to make the original ingredients, too. So you have some options there. Oh, that's that is great. Oh, my god. Isn't gosh. that so cool? You got me on that one. Oh, shoot. That looks so good. <laughs> All right, you thought I was joking, didn't I? That's really good. Okay, so we're going to have a little vino here in a minute. Best value in wine we've ever done at HSN, and chefs picked them all. So you've got to stick around to see it. This is such a good offer. It even shocked me. Maybe the wine? But first, let me tell you about our uh, VIP event. Okay, so here's what's happening. Uh, if you spend $75 or more right now, only today on your HSN card, we're going to take an additional $15 off. And remember, when you spend $75 every day right now, you're getting free shipping on everything that you purchased all day long. So it's kind of a double yes. Uh, so that is available. Check out our card on HSN.com if you don't have it. Also, we have a ton of Black Friday deals. And here's what's really interesting about those. Those deals are ending randomly. I had one in my particular Trisha Nash show a couple hours ago, and that was the last chance time to get it. So if you see a Black Friday deal, because we as hosts don't even know when they're gonna end, they're starting to end just randomly. They'll just be over, and you're getting our lowest price of the season right now. So check out all of our deals happening on HSN.